I highly, highly recommend if you're looking for like a little bit more versatility out of your compact cart. Um, be sure to check out Disc Golf 3D Prints. What's up locals? Today we take a look at a uh, new, kind of unique add-on to your compact cart. This one comes to us from Disc Golf 3D Prints. And uh, this is really interesting little product. What you have here is a storage box that fits right on the back of your cart. It uses the same screws that you used for either your drink holder or your, um, you know, disc retriever if you've got some sort of like holder that would screw in there. But this is these were originally used for your sort of cup holder uh, mechanisms on your Zuka compact cart. Um, so these this box um, was designed really carefully. I've got it a little bit loose right now so I can show you. But the bottom of this actually slopes on an angle so that when you tilt back you're not um, risking ground clearance, you know, on sort of like rougher terrain. This angle that they've put in here uh, means that when you're tilting, you know, you're not, a, you're not dealing with a, a, a bottom on here that's going to potentially bottom out. Um, it gives you like a really nice little bit of space here. Um, you know, I can fit um, like a, my range finder, I could fit a towel, I could fit a drink in here. And, you know, while I absolutely love my compact cart, you know, storage can be a slight issue. You know, I've got these side pouches here. And then in terms of the front of it, yes, I've got my rack here. And um, shout out to uh, Goat Towels for our um, very cool license plate on the front here, as you can see. But yeah, I've got room for my discs up top on this rack, but I got a few to throw in here and showcase the storage that the compact cart offers. I've got some nice bright colored stuff today because we are filming in winter as you can probably see. Get these in here. So you can see I've got my discs up top there, holds a nice amount. And I do have room under here, you know, maybe for, you know, a sweater or a light jacket. I've got room in the sides for maybe, you know, some extra discs or, whatever you know um but that's where this comes in so handy is this box on the back it just gives me a little bit more storage and they've done it in such a way that it's no it doesn't change the dimensions of the cart your wheels still if i can show this kind of sideways your wheels are still kind of sticking out further than this box is so it's offering you some nice additional space here um, you know, for a variety of things, but it's this really great little storage box. All right, so once again, um, just a huge thank you to Disc Golf 3D Prints for sending us this storage box. I think they knocked it out of the park with this. I think the coolest thing about this is the uniformity that it creates with your cart. You know, it's the finish is like identical to your Zuka cart. It's high quality, um, you know, really sort of subtle, simple branding on the back of it right now with the QR code there. It gives just a lot of additional versatility. It gives you extra storage because if you were like me, you know, I wanted the size of the compact cart, but I did love some of the additional features of the, like say the all-terrain, for example, where, you know, you got more storage space. But I like the height of this for sitting on it and the height of this for storing. And I think one of the coolest things is the fact that, you know, this box is not any further out than the wheels. So you didn't really, you know, you haven't really added on much in terms of like size, in terms of fitting it maybe into your car or whatever. And because of the way they did the angle on the bottom, even if this thing is like leaning back, it's still sitting, you know, it's not, your clearance isn't affected. So um, they did an amazing job matching this. Um, I highly, highly recommend it. If you're looking for like a little bit more versatility out of your compact cart, um, be sure to check out Disc Golf 3D Prints. I will leave a link down in the description. And uh, yeah, no money changed hands. They did send me this for review, but um, anytime you can add like, you know, extra storage, especially to a cart, because we buy our carts so that we can have like additional functionality, additional seating, maybe additional storage. And, uh, you know, and it didn't really affect anything. They've still got the screw holes in the back here. So I could still technically add on my cup holders to the back of here, but depending what you're using, you may be able to just slide your cup right into or your water bottle or whatever right into here. You can clip your disc golf retriever. If you've got like a clip for your retriever, it could clip on here and then just like literally like rest in the bottom here. So it's just added like a ton of functionality 
You may have noticed that I've got this like sort of blue at the bottom here. I've just affixed a five pound weight to the bottom of my cart for some of the filming and things like that that I do, where I've got like, you know, I'm using my umbrella holder up here to hold the camera and that adds weight to the top of my cart and sometimes makes it top heavy. You know, I didn't experience anything where when I put anything in this box at the back that it, you know, caused it to be too heavy at the back. But do keep in mind that I do have a five pound weight, keeping things centered, keeping things anchored so that if I'm filming or I'm doing anything else, I've got the space, I've got the weight sort of shifted forward uh, to allow me to, you know, kind of trick this card out as I need to so that for filming and things like that, because this be essentially becomes like my tripod on wheels uh, when I'm filming. So, um, but anyway, super cool uh, device here. Very cool to see. Again, people continuing to push like, you know, the boundaries of what your cart can do and the functionality of our, the tools that we love uh, that makes our sport more enjoyable. So once again, my name is Ryan. This is Local. We are local.